What's going on, good people? Young Ben Miles right here. Just wanted to speak on my new book that I've been reading. It has been a phenomenal read up to this point. It's really been helping me with some what call a self-help book. Um, I guess you can call it that, but I feel like I'm reading it to help everybody, which is why I've been sharing um, chapters on my podcast, um, Voices of the Priesthood, on the Anchor app, on uh, Apple Podcasts, on Spotify, on Google Podcasts, on Stitcher, on Pocket Casts. So go check that out when you can. Once again, Voices of the Priesthood. It. If you if you are a man and you intend on being in a committed relationship with a black woman at any point in time in your life, you need to read this book or just listen to me read. Either way goes, it's going to help you expand and learn exactly what you're dealing with and who you're dealing with when you're out here courting um, courting women. It. I would like to say though, it is not a surface level type book. Like she's really digging deep and put on layers of certain shit. So if you can't, you know what I'm saying, if you're not really there yet to understand like where she's going, um, if you get the book, it's a slow read. It's not something you can read quick in a week. I'm not gonna say in a month because I've had the book for a month. And Cause you have to really digest what she's saying it's a lot of back-to-back -back sentences that are heavy like for real it's a lot of just stuff that she's saying like wow she's she's coming up she's spitting this out right now as a black woman yes a black woman wrote this to help black men black men so why wouldn't i listen to that because at the end of the day i gotta remember most women aren't really holding themselves accountable for a lot of their actions, a lot of their thoughts and just things that they do. It's always someone else's fault. The things he says are, the things he says are um, out of spite or her actions are sometimes vindictive. It's never solely because of her why something happens. She can't take that self accountability. So when a woman has placed this much information in a book, to talk about herself ultimately to hold yourself accountable in that way i had to read it ah it was a must read i could not you know what i mean i couldn't pass over it once i stumbled across it um but there there is a certain level of consciousness consciousness and self-awareness that you have to have to really gain and understand what she is talking about if you are still in the place of learning yourself, you might not be ready yet. Um, if you are still in the place of um, not wanting to hold yourself accountable, you're not ready yet. If you are, um, if you are still in your whole phase, you ain't ready yet because it, it's, the book is in a place of trying to correct the connection between men and women. We don't get along now, and I mean, that's obvious. Like, every day, damn near, I mean, it's complaints about he did this, he did that. Like, it's just, it's no understanding there for real. So, if you get a chance, I mean, buy that shit, bro. It's on Amazon, it's 20 bucks. You'll spend 20 bucks this, today, this weekend. At least you will. So just to you know, what I'm saying, try to improve some. I'm getting more into reading because like, oh, I can really hold on and highlight and keep, you know, a lot of the notes on the stuff that I find out. So it's, it's been good for me. So I just wanted to leave and drop that on you guys. Um, I'm here to help, bro. This is part of my life purpose. I can't run away from it. I've been trying to run away, run away from it for like the last five months. So we here. Hey, shoot the questions, man. I love the support. I love the feedback. Holla back.